something must must most definitely must be wrong <laughs> Hi No Limiters, welcome back to my channel where you're educated, entertained and inspired. I'm Cindy No Limits. No Limits because there are no limits to the things that you can do. From you perceive them, you can achieve them. If you are new to this channel, welcome, welcome, welcome and I do hope that you will subscribe, like, share and comment and that you will come back. To my returning subscribers, thank you for being faithful No Limiters. Thank you for sticking and staying. So. Ladies, I know you are kind of upset with me because I gave the men 11 signs to look for when a woman is cheating, right? Well, you will be happy with me today because I am now going to be giving signs that a man is cheating, alright? So men, it's your turn. I'm going to be telling the ladies what to look for when a man is cheating. As always... I'm going to be checking on my notes so let's get right into the video 10 signs to show or 10 signs that you will see when your male partner is che cheating <laughs> cheating all right so let's go first one he accuses you of cheating yes females if your partner is always accusing you of cheating always there is a possibility that he is the one who is cheating hmm so is he always accusing you of cheating check it out because he might be the one doing so another sign is always talking about another woman listen Whenever your man starts to talk about another woman and he's always talking about another woman, maybe a woman at work, at church, a friend that you both know, a mutual friend, somebody that lives close by, or just any female, but he's constantly talking about this person. He seems annoyed with this person and he cannot stand this person. And this person is just, uh, and he's always talking about this person. Hmm. He just might be cheating with this person now remember that cheating is not just physically we also have emotional cheating the cheating that takes place in the mind remember that and you can check out that video along with 11 signs that a woman might be cheating i'm going to be linking i'm going to be posting the links in the description all right so you can check out those two videos so maybe he's emotionally cheating that is why he's always talking about her and he's disgusted with her and he's just finding all reasons for you to think that there's nothing going on with this woman hmm. another sign is self-care routine has changed things have changed this man start fixing up himself in ways that he has never done before He's shaving more regularly. He's going to the barber more regularly. He's buying new clothes. He wants to go to work looking a certain way. I mean, you can tell. It's your man. And if you have been with him for a certain time, you know his routine. So when that routine starts to change, are we talking about the way he looks? When he starts to change and he starts to do things more frequently with his body and he wants to look a certain way, maybe he starts going to the gym and he wants to wear a certain kind of clothing that he wasn't wearing before. Maybe, not in all cases, but maybe, just maybe, he's cheating. He picks fights. He picks fights so that he can leave. He starts an argument and then he doesn't want to stay in the house. He leaves. He get upset and he leaves maybe he's picking a fight because he really doesn't want to stay in the house there's something outside that is attracting him and so he's picking a fight so that he can leave to go be with whomever is outside that is attracting him so he picks fights he starts to talk down about other women he is overcompensating to make you feel secure so he starts to say She's not even cute. I mean, even models 
on TV, you will see somebody who's really beautiful or somebody who's really sexy, and then you will just, ah, she's not all that. He's trying to make you feel extra secure. He's, he, he wants you to feel extra secure because he knows that he's doing something. And so he's making you feel oh so sure about yourself and oh so secure more than he was before. Now of course we have men who compliment their women and will always do that. Yes, but you know what I'm talking about, right? When other women him just start talking about them. She don't look nice and you are prettier than that and you are cuter than that and you are sexier than that and oh you are the only person for me. You are just my kind of girl and there's uh, I, would, I could never talk to somebody like that. Those things look out for them another one he stops kissing you he stops being intimate come on we know this now men they love they love intimacy all right when they are into a woman they love intimacy all right they love to roll in the sheets with their female when they are feeling that woman. And if he isn't showing any sign of wanting to be intimate with you anymore, he's not walking and spanking like he was, he's not just holding you and just kissing you like he was, he's not being intimate with you like he was before, something has changed. Something has changed in the relationship. It could be cheating it doesn't have to be but there's a possibility that it is he's getting all of this somewhere else another sign he doesn't want that anymore so there's no intimacy there's no kissing there's no nothing and he doesn't want to roll in the sheet with you anymore that that cut off something is wrong Something must, must, most definitely must be wrong. He stops talking to you. So he isn't talking to you anymore. You, you aren't, and when I say talking, males, partners, they have times when they sit and they discuss things about work, things about other people. Yes, you and your partner sit and talk about other people, you know, sit and talk about things that you want to accomplish together, sit and talk about the family, sit and talk about the kids, you know, having conversations, meaningful conversations, meaningful communication. And if this has stopped, hmm, maybe he's sharing all of his feelings with somebody else. He's not coming home and talking to you about work anymore. You know, he's not talking to you about something that is annoying him anymore. Maybe he's doing all of this with somebody else. Maybe he's cheating. He gives you too much detail about where he's going or what it is that he's doing. He's giving you lots of details, things that he never used to do before. And he's telling you that we're going to go to the we're going to go to the park with his friends. We're gonna to go to the park today and we're gonna leave at one and then we're gonna to go to the pool hall and then we're going to leave and then we're gonna to go to a party and, and he's just giving you details, overly details, things that he is going to be doing or when he returns he's giving you details upon details every minute of the day he's telling you what it is that he has done again you know your partner was this something that he normally do before is this something that he's just now doing you know your partner maybe he's cheating and he knows that all of these details that he's given to you they really aren't true but to keep your mind from thinking he comes up with all of these. He doesn't want to do things with you anymore. So he doesn't want to go out with you anymore, you know. He doesn't want to do a lot of things that he used to do with you anymore. He doesn't want to do those things anymore. He is interested in somebody else. And so going out with you, whether it's to a movie, whether it's to the park, whether it's to just go buy some ice cream, whether it's to a party, He's not interested in doing those things with you anymore because he's not interested in doing those things with somebody else. So remember I had said that he doesn't want to, well, he wants to discuss his goings and his comings. He wants to give you every detail. 
there's also the flip side to that. He doesn't want to do that. He doesn't want to talk about what he's doing. He doesn't want to say anything. Now, this is somebody who used to tell you, babe, I'm going to a football match, right? And then we are going to go hang out at the bar. But now he doesn't want to give you any detail. Whenever you ask him what it is that he's going to be doing, he gets upset. He doesn't want to. So on one side, maybe he wants to give you a lot of details so that you don't start thinking things. And on another side, he just shuts down. He does not want to talk about anything that it is that he's going to be doing. His friends start acting strange. They become overly friendly and start to give you some extra compliments that they never used to. They start to say things like, Look at Cindy, Sean wifey. You know, the only girl for Sean. Sean, you alone, Sean, look at. He doesn't want anybody else, you know. You are Sean's apple. You are Sean's this and that. And Sean love you, you know. And Sean, come on. Come on. You know that he's out here doing things. You know this. You know. But in order for you to not... Because they don't want you to feel a certain kind of way. They start doing these things. Giving you compliments and trying to enforce the fact that their friend don't want anybody else. He only wants you. You know how it goes, ladies. We can read you males, male friends, when you overcompensate and try to act as if, Oh, my friend would never look at another female. We know you. We know you. And the last one is work schedule change. Change drastically. So he started to work some hours that he never used to work before. And guess what? He has not gotten a promotion. There is no extra cash coming in. So where are you going, sir? Why is it that you are now working 11 hours and 12 hours instead of 8? Hmm what it is that you're doing sir because there's no extra cash coming in so what is it that you're doing just maybe just maybe he is cheating so let's go again he accuses you of cheating one he's always talking about another woman his self-care routine has changed he is all of a sudden picking fights oh there's one that i missed how could i miss this one he is interested in new things. And when I say he's interested in new things, I mean when it comes to the bedroom. Some things we never used to talk about, never used to want to do. All of a sudden, he's interested in these new things. How could I forget that one? Very important. Maybe he's watching some movies or some porno. Or maybe he's cheating. Yes, maybe he's cheating. So that one should be there. He picks, he picks fights, right? He starts to talk down about other women because he's overcompensating to make you feel secure. He stops kissing you. He stops being intimate. He doesn't want any of that from you. He stops talking to you. He doesn't want to discuss his comings and his goings. Or he's giving you too much detail about his coming and his going. He doesn't want to do things with you anymore. He, he, he started acting strange. His friends start acting strange. And they are giving you all kind of lovely sweet compliments that they never used to give you before. And his work schedule changed drastically. All of those are signs that your man is cheating. Maybe cheating. Hmm. Check it out. I might just be right. So, thank you, thank you, thank you so much for watching. And remember to subscribe. Alright? I'm going to be giving you Wally Patty Pan Cheating. Yes. I've had a few experiences, so I know. Alright? Until next time, it's your girl saying the no limits saying bye. One love. She drew closer to me and said to me, yeah, wish this night was forever.